Hare Krishna. Intelligence means to know which thoughts are to be pinned and which to be binned. Suppose we are using a notepad, either a physical notepad or a digital notepad on our device. Then we may make various notes and some notes are so important that we may want to pin them uh, prominently on some desk or even in our desktop and some notes they might just be there about things which we need to do and some notes they have become irrelevant now. So then we bin them that means we put them in the dustbin or we put them in the trash bin in our device we delete them. So the same pragmatic discernment that we exhibit with respect to our notes we need to apply even with our thoughts. Many thoughts pop up within us and some thoughts are so important that they require attention and some may require immediate attention. Some may require constant to, to be constantly remembered. So then those are thoughts which we need to pin them. Yes, I need to do this. So those thoughts which are to be pinned need to be prominently there for us in our consciousness. Some thoughts need to be binned. That means they are just about stray desires, negative emotions and just waste thoughts which come around us. Now when these thoughts come at that time, if we start reading notes which have no relevance to us, then we waste our valuable time. Similarly, thoughts which have no productive utility for us, thoughts, they may be even true, but they may have no productive utility for us. Then those thoughts, we need to bin them. Now we can't physically put a thought into a dustbin, but what we could do is that we can just not pay attention to a thought. Actually, our thoughts become as prominent and as powerful as the attention we give to them. And if we shift our attention elsewhere, then that is the way we can bin the unwanted thoughts. And Krishna talks about the, is in the Bhagavad Gita, when he asks us to use our intelligence properly, in 6.25 he states, Shanai Shanai Ruparame Buddhya Dhriti Gruhi Taya Atma Samstham Manah Kritva Nakinchid Apichinta Yed So Shanai Shanai, gradually, step by step, Uparame, calm down the mind. Buddhya Dhriti Gruhi Taya Intelligence which is sustained by conviction. With our intelligence, we understand this is important. And then even if our emotion starts coming up, saying, think about this, why is this person done like this? Why is this happening? With our conviction, we understand this is not important. This is not what requires my attention right now. And therefore, Atma Samstham fix the consciousness on the self. That means on that which is most important for us. The things that truly matter for us. And even if other thoughts pop up, still we don't pay attention to this. So that intelligence to discriminate between which thoughts are to be pinned and which thoughts are to be binned, that we can develop by studying the Bhagavad Gita and by harmonizing its knowledge and our life's purpose. Then with our life's purpose being determined by spiritual knowledge, we can see which thoughts help us in fulfilling our life's purpose and which thoughts simply distract us. And thus with this intelligence if we act, we will find that our productivity, our mental and emotional energy will be so much more available and so much more usable for us. We will be, more, we'll be happier and we will be much more productive. And if we do this in a mood of service to Krishna, then we will progress toward the supreme fulfillment through absorption in Krishna, through his service and through his remembrance. Thank you. Hare Krishna.